Nathan and Audrey. And yeah, we're going to recap our intermediate Lindy Hop class from the Amora Dance Studio for May 2009. Uh, this month, uh, we started with our footwork variation, which was heel pop on a swing out. So that one is where you're popping your heels away. Okay, so we can start and it goes a one, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. A one, two, three, and four, five, six. And we might get this little suspension. Triple step, don't forget you can also let your eyes bug out when you do this. Triple step, 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 triple and away. Okay, uh, then we worked on kick through Charleston variations. All right, we reviewed our basic kick through Charleston where we start from side by side Charleston. Leaders get the hand in front, hand on the hip on count five, make some space. And remember, when we do our kick through, we want to extend to those corners of the room to get a nice stretch and bring our partner back. We did some toss through variations where we go around and then back to our kick through. We also did a double toss through where we go around twice, once and twice. Okay, from here we also switch to hand to hand. Leaders, we do three kicks your hands, and when we want to go back, we also do three kicks, and don't forget to catch your followers hand. You can close it up, and get back to side by side trucks. Good. Don't forget to keep your arms in this position so that you're always back where your leader left you follows. And also don't forget that hop, constantly hop through it, it makes you more mobile. We also did uh, kick, uh, we did Charleston swing outs, uh, which, uh, which way shall we do that? This one? I think this one. So, swing outs. Look like this. Rock, step, kick, step, double, kick from the lows. Back, step, kick, double, kick. Back, step, kick, double, kick. And we can do a little Charleston circle. Rock, no, let's go. <laughs> We're kind of cramped for room here, but back, step, kick, double, kick. Rock, step, kick. tuck turn and we were talking about the connection on this and what we really want to emphasize is that when we do that rock step getting the stretch in this hand right here and get using our frame followers you want to say followers you want to pull all the way that you can with following through with the hip one two one two one two okay and then when we go to the other direction also follow through yes following through your hip leads you out in the other direction. So gives you this connection, tension in the hand. We feel the stretch all the way through our arm here. So rock, step, triple step, triple step. Yeah, so that was our tuck turn. Uh, also, we worked a little bit on the jump turn. Practice these slowly first. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. A one, two, and down. See you next month in June uh, for our performance series where we've uh, been choreographing our, our butts off, and we hope you join us. So, thank you. Thanks.